What's up guys, TSI Dominator from the Glitch Hunters here again and today it's something a little bit different but also a little bit special um, As you know, I, I don't actually I don't know if I've told you or not but when I started gaming on Xbox like full time I my first game was Assassin's Creed 1 and I have become a I've, because of that game I became a major fan of the franchise and I've started to and I've played every game that's came out but at the same time, I've been playing other games and building up my gamer score. And you might have remembered, like, maybe a year ago, maybe two at the stretch, I uploaded a video about getting to 60,000. Well, today it's something a bit like that, but it's a bit much bigger milestone than 60,000. We're going for 100. As you can see there, we've got 99,970. 9, so we're close. Seen as Assassin's Creed 1 was the game that started me on Xbox, I'm thinking, what game could I do? I, ha I think it's only right that a game that got uh, me to go across the 100,000 mark is an Assassin's Creed game. So, what I'm going to do is we're going to go into. We're playing the Exio Collection right now, which is a remastered edition of Two Brotherhood and Revelations. I was originally intending to use Rogue Remastered. But it would spot uh, it would just spoil a lot of stuff that you've not seen yet. And actually this is kinda of spoiling it too, because I've not seen Assassin's Creed 2 on my channel yet. But it's the best chance I've got because I know of a couple of achievements that I can do to get to a hundred thousand easily. And it's without even spoiling any of the story. There's one achievement which is worth 10G and there's one that's worth 20. If I remember correctly, let me just check this out. Uh tw Yep, we go all the way down to the bottom, and there's an achievement here, which is Man of the People for 10G. Toss more than 300 florins on the ground. Florins is the currency that you use in Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, and as we're going to get that one, and we're going to go for Choir Boy, which is discover the assassin's tomb inside Santa Maria del Fiore, or known as the Duomo. Right, first we've got 12,134. I'm going to use the coin throw ability, and we're just going to stand here and throw some coins. Easy enough. I don't know how long it will take for me to get this achievement because I really don't use this ability much. Um, so this is just going to be a, this is going to be a quick stupid video about getting to this milestone because this is the better part of what eight nine years work worth the time for me. And the fun thing is, I've already. If you, if you go scrolling back through my channel, no, not my channel, my uh, game library. Oh, hang on, something just popped. Man of the people. Toss more than 300 florins on the ground. There we go, 10G. Not as long as it th I thought it'd take. Right, going to skip this guy, and we're going to go into the map, and we're going to go over here. No need to, cr no need to go with the... Uh, Secondary measuring markers and all that because usually I turn them off. I don't need to because as soon as I, as soon as I get this, I'm going to turn it off. I've been, I, I know for a fact I've had this game clocked for a hundred thousand for a few hours now. I've literally had this sitting on my Xbox waiting to get, waiting for me to get some time to be able to record. I did have my girlfriend over earlier, so my, I didn't want to make myself look like an idiot <laughs> any more than I normally do. Not nothing, not to say that's a bad thing having her around. I'll, I'll spend time with it, but eh, time's coming when you just want to make a fool of yourself in front of a camera and you know that you're the only one who's in the room. <laughs> right, so we are going to go into the Duomo and complete the Assassin's Tomb within. Now, if I remember correctly, this is quite a big one and it's quite lengthy, but if, I remember, if I've done my math correctly, yep, we're 20G away. Santa Maria del Fiore, we're at the right place! And I do this, and this could be the beginning of the end of nine years of work. Which probably means I'll die before I get to a, uh, before I get to like a million. <laughs> but anyway. We're gonna start this memory and we're gonna when I get this tomb over and done weight, we're gonna record and after I get this hundred thousand, if it pops, if it pops. Right, take a look at that before I say anything. Take a look at that floor. Does that look like that as a steep drop, or is it just me? 
It looks like it's a street deep drop to me. I have a full bottle of Budweiser sitting here, which I'm going to crack open for when I get 100,000. Because I swear, it is no understatement for how long I've been trying to get it to a mile, this milestone. And I thought, obviously it'd be best to share it with you guys. Whenever I get to a high milestone like this, I'm going to record it. Although, it won't be something like the... I'm not going to do every 10,000. That 60,000 one is because it had been bugging me for a while. Right, we're going to go... Then we start and we're climbing up to the top of a door. <sighs> I just I can't believe that I'm nearly getting here. I mean, you never. When I started gaming, I didn't think that gamers would become such an important thing to me, but now I've played all these games, I'm just thinking, yeah, I'm a bit of an achievement hunter. Oh crap, I misjudged that. I misjudged that entirely. Right, back to the beginning. Right. I've got a can of cola here, I'm going to just crack them because I am thirsty as fuck. I need a drink of cola. Oh, in case you think I'm drinking alcohol before, prior to this. Nope. I don't know if you can see that, but hang on, let me just turn the light on. Oh, for God's sake. No, light's crap. Um... Why is my light on brightest setting too? But no, it is Coca Cola I'm drinking. Because I do plan on drinking alcohol when I celebrate this. So I'm going in here without being pissed. <laughs> I save that for Fridays. I save full time drinking while gaming on Fridays. Because I've become part of a gamer group that will be playing games every Friday night and live streaming it to YouTube on a different channel. But if we do get, if that becomes a thing, then I won't be, I won't even link that, that channel in this video's description because um, it's quite dark. <laughs> the nights we, the game nights we have, we do, we really just pull no punches with the jokes. They can be anywhere from sensible jabs each other to really dark so I'm not going to subject anyone to that because I don't know if any like younger members of the audience are watching right and the fun thing is I'm to do that to get this a hundred thousand I'm using a game which I've completed about five times I swear to god I've completed Assassin's Creed 2 probably around this and I finished this playthrough It'll probably be about the sixth time I've finished. And it's not to say I love the game or anything. It's not because I'm a fanboy of the game. I've, to be honest, Assassin's Creed 2 is one of the weaker entries for me. Mind you, I love them all. I'm, I'm a huge fanboy and I'll defend the franchise to no end. But there are some weak points and Assassin's Creed 2 is really like low of the list for me. It's not the bottom. That goes to Unity. <laughs> We've patched Unity to make it less bug free. I right. Give me a break. I've got like 50 clips on my capture, sort of capture of this, just for Unity, and my god that game is still buggy as anything. Right, I can get back up. Right, we need to get to the top of the church. That goes, that much goes without saying. Name me an Assassin's Creed game where you don't climb up a church. Oh. Yep. Yeah, I swear, first time me and my brother were playing through Assassin's Creed 2, we came into this location and we saw that floor when the camera was panning down at the start and it looked like a deep drop. But the next thing you know, we fall down and it is like a brilliant example of an optical illusion. We genuinely thought we were going to die, but then we just got up like it was nothing, I'm thinking, oh, well, that makes us look like stupid, that makes us look like thick bastards, up we go, oh we're going over here, 
Needless to say, I haven't been through this part of the game in a while, so I don't exactly know what I'm doing. I'm not exactly up to date with it. Oh, yeah, come on, up you guys, here, come on. But this isn't really spoiling. The only reason I picked that to, this achievement to do is because, one, it was 20G, so I could get this easily, along with the 300 florins. But also because I know for a fact this won't spoil anything in the game except the minor part of a uh, side quest in Assassin's Creed 2. And I know some people probably still get up in arms about it, but... Uh, I, that wasn't really my fault. I, was I, I wanted to do an Assassin's Creed game, so either way I was going to be spoiling something. And I can't really do it in Assassin's Creed 1, because that would require me... Like, either... Possibly plugging it back in my 360, because I don't know if it's plugged in right now. And going back through Assassin's Creed 1, and I really don't want to do that. Not to myself, and not to you guys, because Assassin's Creed 1 is boring. You can't skip the cutscenes. I mean, you can't skip them in this one either. But... And it, is, it just looks grey and brown and depressing. Um, I was, as, as I said, I was originally intended to do this in Rogue because I did get to I did get to nine hundred nineteen no nine hundred ninety nine thousand um nine hundred ninety thousand no what am I talking about ninety nine thousand yeah that's what I got to uh. I got to 99,000 on Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Um, and I'm thinking... And I had Rogue Remastered sitting on my... Xbox with like no achievements. And I went, oh, that's a good idea. I could get 1,000G with that game. And record it when I finish it. But then I've played other games since then. And, come, and, unti and unintentionally got achievements. And that's kind of thrown it in a bottle and thrown a wrench into that work. Um... So I've had to improvise and like finango achievements out of nowhere, which is why I chose to do this. Oh, nearly there! Up we go. There we go. Oh, uh, we're just gonna loot this entire place. I can't remember what assassin that is. It's no. It's no amulet, is it? No, I mean it has a snake on it, doesn't it? I believe it is an Atomine. Eh? I honestly don't know which assassin this is. Poison. What'd I get? Hang on. Let me see what I got. Seal of Ildani. Okay, I don't know what assassin that is. But that's that done. And hopefully. Come on. Come on, pop your bastard. Oh, it popped. 20G, AC2, choir boy. Now, let's hope I've done my maths correctly. I've done it! 100,000, baby! Oh, I have been waiting nine years, and it's finally done. Oh. Nine years, and I've finally completed Assassin. I've completed night. Da, da, da. Use your words, Adam. A hundred thousand gamer score. It is done. I have got a hundred thousand. I can finally go back to doing random shit in other games for achievements. And it's just occurred to me that if I want it, this achievement. If I wanted to get to 100,000, I know a perfect game that could have been good. But again, it would require me plugging in a 360, and I don't want to do that. And that was Toy Story 3, because I, I'm sick of telling people how much I hate that game. I can't get the final achievement. I just can't. Oh, I just can't believe that's happened. And I'm ranked 2 in my game of score leaderboard. All that is going to be changing. How far ahead is it ahead of me? 5G! He's 5G ahead of me! Oh, that is, that is definitely changing. Oh, 100,000. You have no idea how happy I am, guys, truly. 
I would turn the camera to address you directly, but I'm sitting in a boiling room. We need to use your own, and my light is shit, and it's a picture of black and white. <laughs> it is fucking roasting in here. And my excitement won't be helping matters. I've got caffeine rushing through him, you know. Oh, I am just so happy. I don't know how long it'll be before I can get to 200,000, but we'll see. Now that I have a job, I've got income coming in, I can get games. I can get all the stuff I need to, to get get gamer score easily. And I've also got games with gold. So more gamer score, please. Oh, the amount of time I spent, it feels so validated. And yet everyone will say it's a complete waste of time. But I've done it. I don't care what anyone says. I have got 100,000 and I do not regret a second. Every... I I have went through two Xboxes, numerous games, obviously. I know for a fact I've gone through about four or five Xbox controllers just to get to where I am on the Gamers Gosh. On the Gamers Gosh. A hundred thousand. Oh, right. And just to end this, yes, we're going to end this the Assassin's Creed way. We are going to jump off this church into the Bale of Hay. Oh, feels only right to end it in a, end a video using Assassin's Creed with a leap of faith. Oh, and a feather to boot, 20. Oh, right, so as the fucking day ends in Scotland and as the day ends in Forensic and Assassin's Creed 2, stay safe guys, keep on gaming. And for me and Ezio here, we'll see you in the next video. Catch it.